Jacaranda Insights for Tuesday the 13th of February 2024. A couple of cards here with the centre card I believe today being the main one. This is in reverse and it's the Five of Swords. It's all about us and our personalities trying to work out which purpose and function or task to do first our major priority. So we're grounded here and thinking of the logical and the practical thing to do. We're coming from the heart with the green here, where gut instincts is telling us, no, do this first. The spiritual one, oh my gosh, maybe we just need to leave it to fate and destiny. <laughs> so in reverse, it's just like, to me, it could be even a good thing because it might be that we are sort of concentrating on thinking about one thing now. We've sort of thought of all the chaos and we're actually starting to pinpoint and plant one of those things and I'm pointing to the gut instincts so maybe our gut instincts need to be our radar system today because the star it's interesting because the major arcana card here 17 here she is naked and we know nakedness means that you're really happy in your own skin Keeping balanced in the watery emotional side of things, the invisible side of things, but also she's kneeling on the ground, which is very 3D, very physical and material. Lots of stars with the golden one being you and all these other ones are your helpers. <clears throat> the bird in the tarot always means freedom. So to me, this is the middle card and I think the middle card today is what we should sort of emulate to be that balanced scale. So listening to our intuition, our gut instincts, but also being practical and re real as well, using the reality of what we've learned in this lifetime. Because the last card is a reverse card as well, and it's putting down your thoughts or your swords, putting them down because it's at the bottom of the card, Upright, this King of Swords is always going to be a depiction of evolution, intuition, creativity, expression, listening to your ESP, your third eye, your uh, other messages. So it's a really good rounded person. By the time you get to be King of Swords, you've got a control of your crazy, um, static mind that goes from ping-ponging from one idea and one thought to the next but when it's in reverse are we ping-ponging and carrying on a little bit and out letting our mind get a bit chaotic and really if we do come back to that balanced state of wisdom <clears throat> and reality with the messages from our gut instincts and our higher self so it's sort of like a bit of a mixture it's saying to listen to all the facets of your disco ball you you know remember when we went to the disco i do you may not but it was back in my era and you had a disco ball and it was just sparkling with different colors as it spun around and as you danced your little legs off so to me listen to every little facet of your mirror ball today because it's reflecting something back at you that number one uh, you need to stay balanced at but maybe our thoughts need to be put down maybe old thoughts are coming back in and, and disrupting and causing chaos so we have to quiet our mind and then those ideas and passions and missions and tasks that we need to do will become really clear which one to follow so we have five and the king is one six and of course we have 17 so 17 18 19 20 and another three so 23 two and three is five and five is all about communication and i'm pretty sure we had that yesterday communicating with yourself and communicating with your other more higher that higher intelligence that knowing we just know stuff don't we have a lovely day everyone